Hi, before this video starts, I want to let you guys know that my merch is actually out now. This is the hoodie. I'm obsessed with it. It says Montana on the hood. We have a phone case here. They also say Montana. I know you guys are going to love it, so link in the description to shop it. Get your merch! Okay, let's go into the video. Hey guys, it's Luna. <laughs> The amount of excitement I have for this week's video is insane. So I had a thought and I was like, okay, let me make a video about it. I know that right now is such a tough time for a lot of people, but recently I've been thinking a lot about high school seniors and that they're missing out on a lot of the activities that I enjoyed so much as a senior last year. One of those being prom. If you've known me since last year, you probably saw my prom video, which is one of my favorite videos I've ever filmed, but I was just looking back on that time and how excited I was to, you know, get my dress and get ready and experience high school prom like it's just such a I don't know I feel like you always look forward to stuff like that even though it's not the most important thing in the world you know it's something that I know a lot of you guys if you're seniors we're looking forward to you probably have your dress picked out and all of that so I had a thought why don't I throw one for my subscribers or followers that are missing out basically I asked on my Instagram story I said if you're a high school senior and you're missing your prom and graduation message me because I have a plan and I have so many girls that answered told them I was like I have an idea I would love to throw a zoom prom for you guys so they can hang out with me and I can just celebrate their success and their accomplishments of high school and then we'll have prom hopefully in a couple days I've never done something like this but I'm really excited so I want to do it this Sunday May 17th at 4 p.m. Pacific time on zoom so those are the rules for the zoom prom okay everything's on here I put the zoom meeting link I'm so excited for this okay we have a couple days to prepare let me send this message out out to all the girls that answered. There's so many. Okay. Whoo, this is gonna take me a while. This is not gonna be fun. Whoa, so much. But I'm gonna message all of them. Hopefully they can all make it. I'll see you in a couple days for prom. Okay, you guys, so basically everyone answered and mostly everyone can make it. I'm so excited. Hopefully this works out in a couple days, but before we do prom. Last year for prom, I didn't have a date. I actually asked myself to prom with a cake. <laughs> I never really got that prom experience or any experience ever being asked out to a dance, but you guys know I have a boyfriend, Kai. I'm going to have him ask me to prom. Basically, I'm redoing my prom with a date and with all my best friends, my subscribers. Anyway, I told Kai yesterday that he has to ask me to prom, so he's going to be doing that. Let's see what he comes up with. <laughs> I'm being asked to prom. Stop. I've never gotten this side. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> no! <What>? My first <laughs> time. <laughs> Guys, I finally got asked to prom. I'm not even in high school. <laughs> you got me sugar fish? You didn't have to do that. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is so chic. Oh, that stuff's my favorite. Good morning. It's prom day. Still have yet to take out my dress and see if it fits, but happy prom, everybody. I can't wait. Before we set up, I want to do my nails so that they have time to dry. Let's pick a nail color, shall we? Good thing they're all pink. We have the dress. Hopefully it fits me. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna fit me. I don't know what Kai's wearing. Oh my God, I have to get corsages. I have never done this stuff, you guys. I'm pretty sure this nail paint's from the dollar store. All my nails are about to fall off because I had to take off my own gel and I'm pretty sure I scraped off half my nail. They look pretty bad. Perfect. I need cherries. Mom, I need you. I need you to paint my toenails, please. Because remember last year you did it. Sure. Slipping through my fingers all the time. You know, everyone says that we're Donna and Sophie. Trying to calm down. I think that I'm just very nervous. We're working on our hair now. So last year, I did an extension ponytail, like very Ariana Grande-esque. This year, I wanted to do this hairstyle that I saw Madison Beer have, and she had a similar dress, so I'm gonna try that. Okay, hair is all curled, so now I want to figure out how she did her hairstyle. I think I want to put like a bow in the back. And tie bow. I can't even see it. Is that cute? Good thing is I'm out of foundation. <laughs> Maybe this will work. 
Oh, that looks good. I'm using Tarte Shape Tape. So while I get ready, I want to talk to you guys about something that is essential in getting ready every day, and that is deodorant. This video is actually sponsored by Native Deodorant. You guys know I've worked with them so many times in the past. I truly, truly believe in their product. That's why I keep talking about it. So Native is a natural deodorant. It's free of sulfates, parabens, aluminum. It is vegan, cruelty-free, has everything you need in a deodorant. So instead of all those nasty things, Native uses natural ingredients such as coconut oil and shea butter. Everything that I put on my body, I want to be very careful because I want to make sure that I'm only using natural products. So I made the switch to Native and I have never looked back. Native is so great because it dries so fast. It's not sticky. The scents they offer are so amazing. They last all day. If this doesn't show you guys how obsessed I am with Native, I don't know what will. I also have like three more in my car. My three favorite ones right now, this one, you guys, this one is Blackberry and Plum. I've never smelled anything like it. I put this on one day not even knowing it was the new one and I kept smelling this really good smell. I was like, what is that mom? Like are you burning a candle? And then I realized it was my armpits. So this is a new one as well. Pear and Linden Blossom. I don't even know how to explain it. It's like the freshest thing. And then my classic one that I always talk about in my videos is Citrus and Herbal Musk. This one smells like man fresh out of the shower. And they offer free shipping to all these locations listed up here on the screen. Three deodorants are normally $36, but if you use my link in the description and my code listed here, you'll get three for $24. That's 33% off plus free shipping. Let's smell great together, you guys. Let's get the makeup going. I'm still running late. <laughs> Using Hannah Malocious palette just to do a little bit more bronze. I want to be chiseled. I'm using this cream blush from Sugar Rush. I put way too much. For eyeshadow, I want to do something like, I don't know, just brown, simple. That's red, but whatever. My mom is downstairs decorating. I don't know how it's going, but knowing her, it's probably looking so good. I don't know what I'm doing at all. I'm just gonna stick highlighter everywhere because what I always do. <laughs> We've come to the terrifying part of doing my eyeliner, which is literally always impossible for me, so wish me luck. It's going good so far. <laughs> I knew it. Wait, okay. Great, that one looks really good. This one, not so much. Okay, on to brows. I'm using my Anastasia brow pencil. I'm so nervous, you guys. I'm like jittery. I just don't know what we're doing, how to react. If this is even gonna work, I don't even know. Okay, mascara, highlighter, and we're done. Perfect. Looks kinda good. I'm just gonna use this lip liner by MAC. Okay, I feel like the makeup is done. Let's just fix hair and put the dress on and see how it looks. This is so exciting. Okay, we have 40 minutes till prom. Let's do this. I'm from Toronto, Ontario. I'm from Michigan. I live in Alberta, Canada. I'm from Montreal, Canada. I live in Squamish, British Columbia. I'm from Lakewood, California. And I'm from Fargo, North Dakota. I live in Chicago. I'm from Nashville, Tennessee. And I'm also from Nashville. I'm from a small town in Pennsylvania called Chester Springs. I'm from Toronto, Canada. I'm from Canada, Pickering, Ontario to be exact. I am attending Carleton University next year. I have decided to go on a gap year. Next year, I will be attending the University of Michigan. I will be going to Dawson College. Next year, I'm going to Meredith College in North Carolina. I will be going to Chapman University. And this fall, I'll 
be attending the University of Arizona to study business and film. I will be going to Wolford Laurier. Decided now that I'm going to take a gap year. I will be attending Florida State University this fall. And I'm going to Chapman University in Orange County. Next year, I'm going to be attending Millican University to major in musical theater. And next year, I'm going to the University of Ottawa for sociology. Next year, I'll be attending the University of Vermont in Burlington. So I want to be a physical therapist for dancers, and actually, you really inspired me talking about body dysmorphia and mental health of dancers and all that kind of stuff. So I'm also going to be minoring in psychology because I'm really passionate about wanting to help young dancers and young athletes. And you are such a big inspiration to me because you told me that I should be proud of myself for who I am and that you love me to the moon and back, and that really means a lot to me. Perfect. Okay, everyone get your drinks up. This is a toast to the class of 2020. Happy prom, happy graduation, happy everything. I'm so proud of each and every one of you and getting to hear your stories and what you're doing next year and everything, all your accomplishments is so cool. You guys should be so proud of yourself. And here's a toast to you guys, the class of 2020. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers to the class of 2020. Cheers to that. Cheers. 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 Okay everybody, 2020 prom is complete. This was so fun and I loved talking to everyone that was on the Zoom. It was so, so cool to hear where everyone was from, what they're doing next year, and just celebrate their accomplishments. But I encourage every single one of you guys to be creative, come up with something, to make it on your own because although it's tragic for so many people out there, you guys are living through historical times. So I encourage all of you guys to get creative and create your own types of proms, graduations, yearbook photos, all of that. To me, at least, that seems more special and that is a really cool story to tell in the future. So congratulations to all of you guys. I'm so proud of you. Class of 2020, this is to you. I love you guys, and I will see you next week. Bye.